Good morning, my dear students. How are you all? I hope you all are fine. Our today's topic is computer and its working. In this, we will learn that how our computer works and from where this computer word comes. Now, we will learn that what is this computer system. Firstly, we will learn that from where this word comes. This computer words from, from the word compute. What is the meaning of this compute word? Compute means to calculate or to count. Earlier, we are using the computer to doing the calculations on it. Like we are using nowadays calculator in the same way. And now we will learn that what is this system? System is a collection or a combination of components. That's why we call it computer system. In our computer, lots of devices are there now. And the, some of uh, the components are hardware and some of the components are software. Firstly, we will learn about the hardware components. Our first one is monitor. Second is keyboard, third is mouse and fourth is CPU. These four devices are our main devices through which our computer system um, uh, can work. Like if we are not having keyboard then it's not possible for us to do the work in the same way. If we are not having CPU then also it's not possible to do the work. And two devices, two output devices are there like printer and speaker for a while if we are not having printer or speakers then also we can do the work on the computer that's why i am saying that these four devices are main devices monitor keyboard mouse and cpu and two other peripheral devices output devices are there that is speaker and our printer now we will learn that what is computer computer is an electronic device which works on ipo cycle as i discussed in class also what is the meaning of this ipo cycle input process output we give instructions to the computer it process on that and gives us output so the definition of the computer is same like computer is an electronic device because it works with the help of electricity it's an electronic device and which receives the data that means input i and from the user manipulate it according to the specific rules that means process p and convert the information to the result that that is our output that is o that means computer works on the cycle ipo and after that we will learn that what is this data when we give the instructions to the computer that means we are giving the raw material that was not useful for us that is called the data data is the collection of raw and unorganized facts that means having number including sounds and uh, words but not making any sense that is called a data after that, what is this process? Process means an action which we take, action taken by the computer or as I given you example in the class also that when we are having some of the oranges and we want juice of oranges, the time when juicer processing on that oranges, the juicer makes the juice, that time juicer is our processor. In the same way, in our computer, CPU perform the work of processing. All the work done by our CPU. CPU is also known as processing device as well as brain of the computer. Now, what is information? The meaningful data, the output which we get from the computer after doing the processing is called the information. What is hardware? All the physical components attached to the computer are called hardware like mouse, CPU, our keyboard, printer, all the devices to which we can touch and feel are called hardware devices. What is software? Software is a set of instructions that tell the computer hardware 
what to do when to do like ms paint window and our uh, ms office all the softwares installed in the computer to which we can't touch are called a set of instructions now what is user user means who uses the computer the person who uses the computer like when we are using the computer that time we are the user thank you and have a nice day